everyone, I'm Joe, Field Application Engineer from Newberton Technology. Today, I will introduce you the Newberton New Micro Family M251, M252 series for support package, as known as BSP. I'll first show you how to get a BSP file and then talk about the usage of the driver. First, open the browser and enter Newberton website. Select Products, New Microcontrollers, M23 Core, MCU, M251, M252 Series. And then select Resource. Click Software. You'll see the board support package here. Click it to download. Inside the BSP folder contains three folders and one document. Document folder includes the information of the driver reference guideline and revision history. Library folder includes the information of the driver header and source file. Sample code folder includes the information of driver sample code. Readme file is the guideline of new micro family M251 M252 series BSP. In the library folder includes four folders. The first CMSYS folder includes the information of Cortex Microcontroller Software Interface Standard version 5.1.1 definitions by ARM Cooperation. And the device folder includes the information of CMSYS compliant device header file. The Smart Card Library folder includes the information of Smart Card Library binary and header file. Standard Driver folder includes the information of all peripheral driver header and source files. In the sample code folder, you can see nine folders. The first one, Car Reader, demonstrate the USB chip car interface device smart car reader function. The next folder, Cortex M23, demonstrate the usage of Cortex M23 MPU. Half fault sample, demonstrate the information the system will show during a hard fault situation happened. Inside the ISP folder, it demonstrates the in-system programming through six interface. Includes the first one, development firmware upgrade. Two, human interface device. Three, I2C. Four, RS485. Five. Serial for refill interface, and the last one, UART interface. Inside the power management folder, it demonstrates some power modes with different power consumption levels and wake up time. Inside semi host folder, it demonstrates how to print and get a character through the IDE console window. In STD driver folder, and demonstrate the usage of M251, M252 series new microcontroller peripheral driver. In the template folder, it demonstrate a project template for the M251, M252 series microcontroller. And inside the XLM folder, it demonstrate how to create execute only memory library and how to use it. That's all for today's video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. If you want to have more information, please contact us. Bye bye.